Hey guys, it's Danielle. So, I'm sitting here at home. Um, crocheting. And, uh, and watching um, some recorded episodes of Walking Dead on the DVR. So disappointed. I just found out tonight that last week's episode was the final episode of the season. I hate waiting from the show. Anyways, <clears throat> so I'm working on my granny squares. And um, I've been working on my granny squares, like, you know, on and off here and there. Whenever I have free time and stuff during the week. So, you remember this square that I was contemplating on this yarn right here? I had another square that was a six inch square that was done out of nothing but this multicolored yarn that I got at Big Lots. I love that yarn because it's so funky and different colors. But, um, you may remember that... The square that was all the multicolored, I was contemplating <clears throat> whether I should leave it as it is or take it apart and rework it because it was just so not matching the rest of my color motif here for my blanket. So... What I decided to do the other night, I decided I was just going to rip the thing apart. And I was going to rework it and still use it, but make it more subtle. So, I'm going to leave this square as is. Because it's got the teal color around it, and I think it'll look alright. So, I did this one with just the center which I don't think is bad and I did this one with it in the third row and then I did this one and of course I've got um, strings hanging so I'm leaving my strings until I'm ready to put the thing together but did the second row on this one and then another center so, I think those are a lot better than just the solid colored one. So, and then I've worked on some other squares this week. So, that one. That one. I'm not going to go and tell you what all the colors are, because Z told me before, Girl, you talk too much about them squares. This one. And this is actually uh, variegated and then the blue and then variegated again but it's kind of just like blending together and that's the same yarn that variegated is the one I used in my um, Bob Wilson solid granny square bag and this one purples and blue or green this one this one I'm loving these colors I can't wait until I get my blanket all done and see how it turns out. I think it's going to be really pretty. Yep, that's the front. Um, and then, of course, my one that I'm working on now. But, um, so yeah, that's all I've been up to. Just making granny squares, and I mailed out, um... The package for from my giveaway. Um, I think I had mentioned in my last video that the first person I had drawn um, didn't contact me. So the second person that Caden strawed um, ended up being the winner. And um, that was uh, Yarn Addict 30 Amy. Um, I mailed her package out and she should have it tomorrow. Yay! I hope she likes it. Amy, if you're watching, I hope you like your yarn. Hope you make something pretty with it. So, yeah. 
And here I am with my tattoos of showing. Anyways, so I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna sit here and watch my recorded episodes of Walking Dead and get the hook in and get some more of these squares done. So I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.